Hey, hey everyone, everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to, to Five Minute Eats. All right guys, we are continuing spicy chicken sandwich week and today we have the KFC version of it and I believe it is called their spicy classic chicken sandwich. But basically it looks, at least in their own pictures, a lot like the Popeyes one where it has a crispy chicken sandwich thingy, chicken patty. It has some pickles and it has some spicy sauce on there. So is that what we're gonna get in here? I hope so, but we don't know. So guys, we're actually living through chicken wars right now. Spicy chicken wars. Ever since Chick-fil-A, man, they just been expanding and they are the dominant fast food chain. So everybody's hopping on the spicy chicken train, right? And it's been pretty good because Popeyes, they got a pretty good sandwich. Arby's has a pretty good one, and now KFC, the Colonel, which I feel should have happened a long time ago. Right, that's a little bit weird that they did not, because a lot of these places were coming out with like just regular chicken sandwiches, and I feel like the Colonel just kind of kept it in the bucket for a long time. And if you've seen our day one video, we've told you some of these chicken sandwiches are not surviving the chicken wars. Yes. And guys, if you're new to our channel, Basically, we review everyday grocery items, so before you spend your hard-earned money, let us tell you if it's worth it. All right, so what we've got here is a big ol' chicken. Then on the top, we've got some spicy-looking sauce. On the bottom is more spicy-looking sauce, but also some pickle chips on here. It is messy. We got a messy one here. So I cut it open so that we can kind of see what we've got in here. So there's our, our chicken. So guys, it looks visually pretty good. It looks pretty thick is what it looks like, right? And it smells very pickly. Mm. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right guys, I'm ready. I'm ready. So our rating system, thumbs up we buy it again, thumbs down we would not. So for me, this is a big thumbs up. Number one reason I like this is the thickness of the chicken. Oh, you like a thick, thick chicken? Yeah, because you know how it a is. Thickened. You know how it is often at fast food places. <laughs> the the chicken is primarily just mostly breading and a little bit of chicken. So just like the Popeyes, you get a lot of chicken. Now, um, if I had to complain about anything, it would be the breading. It's mm. it's double breaded, and I'm not like really crazy about it because. Um, sometimes it's a little too hard, you know, mm. but not that bad. Now the sauce, really, really spicy. And just so you know, that's actually what makes this sandwich spicy. It's the sauce. Mm -hmm. It's real spicy, man. Um, I would say it's spicier than the Arby's. Mm -hmm. I would, I would agree with that. Yes. Now the bun, I like that it was, um, not too thick. So the, the bun actually, I don't mind. I do, do you kind of feel like the bun kind of steams itself in this yeah. bag also? Yeah, so I like that. Because the McDonald's one, the, the thing was actually just soggy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So they did a great job on it. And uh, yeah, so pretty much thumbs up. I'll add with you. Okay, so for me, this is going to be a thumbs up as well. This is a darn good chicken sandwich. And you know what I feel like kind of makes it? Well, first off, it's definitely the sauce. The sauce is really, really good. And Very can I, spicy. Can I add something here? Go ahead. So when I was doing my review, if you're wondering, man, like he seems a little off because it's <laughs> my mouth is burning. burning. I've, I've had something to drink and still it's going. So I was just, you know, a little out of it because of the, the fire. Yeah, it's it's very, very spicy. It's still burning a little bit. I feel like I'm slurring a little bit also because it's fiery hot. So if you really like spicy things, you'd probably really love this. But I feel like actually the breading kind of makes it for me. And it's not really even the breading, it's the, the special herbs and seasonings or whatever that they use. It tasted really good. Like just the chicken in and of itself was well seasoned. I also felt like for it being such a large, thick chicken breast, it did not have any scary bits in it. It wasn't spongy or stringy or chewy or anything like that. It just tasted like really good chicken. And we got to talk about the price here. Yes. Three freaking 99, amazing. And for amazing chicken also, cause Honestly, I figured that this may not be good quality, especially whenever I saw how thick it was because sometimes that's when they mess up is when they go for too big of a piece 
and then they cut the corners on quality. This one was really good, and I actually really enjoyed the pickles on here as well. I felt like it really balanced everything out because you had like that super, super spiciness, really well seasoned chicken, and then you get that little kind of tanginess of a pickle. Not too much though, it wasn't like overkill, and they also had a nice crunch to them still too. So guys, to sum it up, thumbs up, thumbs up, and if you guys buy from Amazon, use your Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc., and don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.